But we do want to begin at the San Luis Obispo Airport, where today's storm delivered a knockout blow to the control tower. Keith Carls is live at the airport with the very latest for us. Keith, good evening. Hi, Melissa and Scott. At least three lightning strikes hit the San Luis Obispo Airport during the storms today, knocking out power briefly to the airport, the airport tower here behind me, and the terminal building. Now, what I can tell you is, is that uh, CAL FIRE responded to the airport tower, and the tower was evacuated briefly as firefighters searched the building. No smoke or fire was found. But the lightning strikes and loss of power resulted in at least one canceled flight and other flights delayed. Basically, lightning pretty much struck this place and all the power went out. But they didn't reimburse me with a new ticket, so I'm still being able to go home tonight. So we got here about, I don't know, 2.15. 2 and. That's when we found out that the tower had been hit by lightning, and so we're just waiting to see whether or not they're gonna reopen the tower. And if not, I think we'll be spending the night here. Now, flight arrivals and departures resume this afternoon, but the disruption had a ripple effect on service. Now, tonight, both the runway and taxiway lights are out of service. They are not operational. That means there are no flight arrivals or departures happening tonight. Airport service is expected to resume at first light tomorrow, weather permitting. However, airport managers have no idea how long it's going to take to get those runway and taxiway lights operational. So, in the meantime, the best bet right now is to call the airlines to see how it's affecting flight arrivals and departures in and out of San Luis Obispo Airport. Live at San Luis Obispo Airport, Keith Corals, KCOY 12 Central Coast News.